Hi guys, in this video, we are going to check out 10 best places to live in Connecticut. It's among the most beautiful states in America. It's a charming mixture of coastal towns and countryside havens, there's plenty to be loved about this part of New England. Unlike the other U.S. states, Connecticut can reach the Atlantic coast, calling everyone who loves surfing. Since it's located on the Atlantic coast, the weather can be rough sometimes, but the atmosphere becomes stunning when the sun is shining. Whatever the case, there's plenty to consider, from having access to quality public schools, low living costs, affordable housing, and accessible transportation routes. We don't want to leave anyone feeling overwhelmed, we've made this list to provide you with an idea of the possibilities you can choose from this fantastic state. If you like our content, please do subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you will be notified for our next videos. Glastonbury It's a suburb in Hartford that we consider an all-rounder. The western boundary runs alongside the Connecticut River. The houses are built in the traditional New England style, and you will get good value for your money. The typical home value is $400,000, and the average rent is $1,600. The population is just shy of 35,000, who has a median household income of $108,000. The education in public schools is good. It has one of the largest school districts located in Connecticut and has 46 excellent schools to choose from. Greenwich Lying just south of Stamford is the suburban area of Greenwich even though it is the home of 62,000 residents, it is considered a city on its own. The houses here are among the most expensive yet, with an average of $1.6 million. While rent is only $1,800 per month, there's an enormous amount of residents renting in this area. As a suburb of New York City, it's safe to conclude that the majority of the residents are highly paid, city workers. This assumption is partially confirmed with the average annual salary of $152,000. If you're making that amount of money, spending more than $2,000 per month isn't an issue in the least. Riverside It's a remarkably wealthy suburban area that is an overflow of Greenwich, another area of New York City. It is difficult to find a change of $1 million in Riverside, however, the properties are stunning and, to put it mildly, breathtaking. The median household earnings are $215,000. Even though many of these homes are purchased with loans, the prices are value for money according to the market. The average rent is currently $2,650. Riverside is comparable to the rest of Connecticut in many ways, particularly in public schooling. Families who would like their children to get the best schooling, seriously consider moving. New Canaan It's a strong candidate for being the most desirable location in Connecticut. Although it's located within state borders, New Canaan is classed as a suburban area. New Canaan does not roll in the first place due to the high price tag with almost every house. The median house value calls for an investment of $1.5 million. However, a few modest, cozy houses are under the threshold of $800,000. Undoubtedly, it is a prestigious area. The average rent is huge at $2,950. The average income of residents is $103,000 a year. The schools are outstanding, and residents' earnings mean that everyone lives comfortably. Ridgefield The town of Ridgefield is located within Fairfield County, with a population of 25,000 people. It's an urban town, at the same time, a rural feeling is also present. The majority of homes are detached and are scattered, Many homes on the market feature huge gardens or even grounds that make you feel you live in a rural setting. The ideal of both worlds, some may argue. The median home value is $650,000, and the average rent for a one-bedroom home is currently $1,900. The median household income is $133,000, one of the highest in the state. Connecticut is one of the most secure states in the USA which can be a great assurance for anyone considering to move. Old Greenwich 
It's a coastal neighborhood in Fairfield County, and is among America's wealthiest communities. If you're looking for an ideal location to raise your family in a safe, clean and truly upper-class community, then Old Greenwich is the place for you. The locals describe the area as peaceful, quiet and near the beach. This area requires a substantial investment, if you decide to buy a home. There's no way around the block, it's an affluent location, and the median house value is $1.5 million and some properties worth over $2 million. Even the median rent for a month is high at $2,650, well worth it for ultra-modern condos that overlook the coastline. Simsbury It's another suburb in the capital city of Hartford. There are 25,000 residents living here, and it certainly has an urban feel. The value of homes is rather affordable compared to other regions. The median home value requires the sum of $390,000. There are many classic New England-style homes in the area. The average rent for an apartment is $1,750. With the average family bringing home over $100,000 per year, the expenses should not be a cause of concern for the current residents. Avon. A town in the Farmington Valley of Hartford County, and has a population of 18,000 people. Considered as one of the top locations in Connecticut to purchase a house. With a comparable price to Weetog, and the median home value is $375,000, you'll require $400,000 before considering to buy a home here. At a median rent of $1,350 per month, it's easy to understand that only 15% of the residents live in rented houses. For $555,000, you can get a grand four-bedroom, double-story home with large gardens and a winding driveway. The crime rate across Connecticut is low, and Avon is no different. Weetog This neighborhood has a village-like vibe, and a tiny town home to just 3,000 people. The home prices are lower, meaning Weetog is more affordable than an aspirational place to live. It's the most desirable location in Connecticut to purchase a home. The property prices averages at $315,000, which is well affordable for a typical working American. The average apartment rent is $1,700. The average household income is $133,000. The crime rate in the region is extremely low, possibly because of the low population size or the friendly attitude of residents. Families, retirees, and the millennial generation are all welcome here with open arms. West Hartford It's a charming and reasonably priced suburb in the capital city. The area is extremely popular with young people, possibly because house prices are lower. The median home values are about $320,000, which is affordable for families with a typical income. The average apartment rent is $1,450. Locals say there's plenty to appreciate, and it's the perfect place to raise family. West Hartford is an affluent suburb that features a median income of more than $100,000 per household. The education quality is excellent. The town is safe and secure, and there are plenty of recreational opportunities available for all ages, including swimming, hiking and social clubs. <music>